Welcome to the Zest Show. Today we're going to be making uh, buffalo, um, buffalo mac and cheese. And the ingredients for, it's, and it's one of my favorite dishes because I love mac and cheese, especially with breadcrumbs. And so, to, um, the ingredients for buffalo mac and cheese with, with chicken are, um, uh, um, three, uh, three cups, three tablespoons of uh, butter, three tablespoons of flour, two cups of milk, um, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, half a teaspoon of onion powder, um, ha um, and half a teaspoon of ground mustard, and also a little bit of salt and pepper. And then. So a third cup of sour cream, half a cup of buffalo sauce, four ounces of cream cheese, one and a half cup of mozzarella cheese, um, one cup of cheddar cheese, um, eight ounces of uh, macaroni pasta, and then one and a half cups of shredded chicken. So now as you can see I've already cooked the macaroni and the shredded chicken. So now you can start get mixing. We're going to wait for the butter to melt, and let's add the butter. Three tablespoons of butter um, inside, and it started melting. So now we're going to add, we're going to lower the heat and add three tablespoons of flour. Okay, and then. We're going to um, mix it and then leave it for one minute and then we're going to stir it for one minute and then we're going to add our two cups of milk. You can see the flour has been cooked for one minute so now let's add our two cups of milk. That's one cup. Mix. Mix well so that the flour is well mixed in. And then we're going to add our spices. So now let's add our, um, first we'll add our onion powder. And for all of these, we have half a teaspoon. Now, to our onion powder, we're going to add our garlic powder. Okay, and then... How much of garlic powder? Uh, half a teaspoon for all of these, uh, all the spices, garlic powder. And now, let's add our, um, our ground mustard. And all of these are half a teaspoon. Okay, and then... We're going to uh, add some pepper. And then we're going to add a pinch of salt. So we're going to put, put a pinch of salt and then we're going to allow the milk to come to a boil. So now that the milk has come to a boil, let's lower the, let's lower, let's lower the heat and we're going to start added, adding the cheese. What is that? And so now we're going to add four ounces of cream cheese. Next, let's add our um, half cup of buffalo sauce. Now we're going to mix our buffalo sauce. Okay, now let's add our, uh, a third cup of cream cheese, I mean of sour cream. Okay, 
Let's mix. Now, let's add one and a half cup of, of mozzarella cheese. Let's mix. Now we're going to add our, uh, one, the, the other half cup. Cheddar cheese. Now let's mix. Everything for our sauce is already in. So now let's add our pasta and our chicken. Okay, so now this is eight ounces of pasta of macaroni pasta. So now let's add the chicken. Now our chicken, our pasta, and our sauce has all been well mixed, as you can see. So now let's put it on our cooking dish, and then we're going to add our panko breadcrumbs, and then make sure while you're doing all of this, um, you have your oven at 350, uh, preheated at 350 so you can add it in. So now let's add our... Um, our pasta into our cooking dish. Um, I already added one tablespoon of olive oil, so now let's add our panko breadcrumbs. How much of panko breadcrumbs? Um, half a cup of panko breadcrumbs. Okay, now let's put our cooking dish into the oven uh, um, at 350 for 15 minutes. So now we're going to have our amazing dish is our amazing dish getting ready inside the oven. Now I took out our pasta from the, um, the oven at 350 for a few minutes and um, now let's serve it to my brothers. Okay. Zachary, I'm guessing you want some too. Mmm. It's very fiery. Mmm. Okay, so please, please cook this for your family. It's an awesome dish. Especially if you want to use, get spice into pasta. It's a great dish. Please cook this for your family. Um, please follow me on Facebook, I mean, follow me on Insta Instagram, like my videos on Facebook and YouTube, subscribe to me on um, YouTube, and like my page on Facebook. Bon appétit.